Hey everybody, uh, we're here at the uh, old Sunnydale Elementary School now. I just thought I'd film these nice new tennis courts that are going in. Uh, but as you can see, they've got several layers of fences around to keep folks away from them. Now my understanding is that uh, Highline High School is going to be using these because they're right across the street. And that's all well and good, but uh, I guess these are not open to the taxpayers that have financed their construction. Even though this entire field used to be open to the public, people could just go. There actually is still this half, the unimproved half of the field, the south half. But now you see a bit of a divide here. So there's two levels of fences, um, kind of intermediate fences, before you get to the big tall fence. And that one has a padlock on the doors. The, uh, the playground, that's the new playground, and that's uh, a little bit uh, older, I guess. There also used to be a, a playground on that half, too, back when I went to elementary school here. You can see even some public bathrooms, which is really nice. So I've, uh, you know, talked about this before. Now Transformburian is operating out of the building. So uh, I think theoretically we could actually get access to a few of those building exits that are located inside the fence. But you've still got the padlocks on the, uh, the doors. These are the uh, entrances to the gym here. We actually, uh, I think someone was eating their lunch maybe on or under the play structure there. One of the, the homeless folks. We actually had somebody call the police. I guess they were concerned. Keep in mind there were no kids like trying to play there, you know. Uh, I don't ever see a lot of kids at this park, even before Transformburian moved in. So I'm just going to go walk around the building and film the other side. Anyway, uh, yeah, Highland Security is uh, pretty vigilant, so maybe they'll be out. And, uh, as, as I've determined previously, they don't respond too well to filming. It's actually a pretty nice school, you know. Obviously, I went to elementary school here. This is the uh, southeast entrance. Got the flagpole right there. No uh, flag on it. Over here you got the uh, Des Moines Memorial. It's a World War I memorial. It's got some names inscribed on there. You also got the Latinos for Trump sign. That's recent. Somebody just recently put it up. Just as somebody who's into politics, I, I notice all the signs. You can see we got some signage right there. This uh, 
you see the the tape marks on the ground uh, those are for social distancing in case people want to line up the uh, main entrance is around here around here there's uh, this as you can see the food bank is at other entrance this one's the clothing closet and then the meals uh, line up on that ramp there you can see the uh, inside windows of the clothing closet and then uh, this wing here that we're actually not really using I forgot that the, uh, the exit here was blocked off so I'll have to go back but I'll just give you a good view you see the basketball courts nobody can use those right now uh, And of course, I'll, I'll go around and I'll film the rest of that for you from the north side. There's the uh, Transformburian sign. I don't know if I caught that. You got a, a porta potty out here that's also for the construction workers. So that makes me think the actual bathrooms probably aren't ready yet. I haven't actually seen anyone working out here recently, so I assume that it's mostly done. But all this, you know, uh, additional area that could be used for parking is also blocked off. Of course, you got that great sign there that says do not block drive. You know, tell that to whoever put the fences up. Now, this uh, is actually a pretty low fence, so if someone really wanted to get in that area, they could hop over it. There's a padlock there. And once again, I would guess this is maybe four feet high. You got the nice uh, work they've done here. And this uh, this slope here used to be the old path that they're putting in plants to try to discourage people from using it as a path. I mean, it's a really nice tennis court. I don't play tennis. I just want to get in there and, like, take some pictures for Instagram. But, uh... I don't know. They've, uh... really secured the perimeter here, so your, uh... your common folk cannot get in and play on the nice tennis court 